What is up guys, it's Squib here, back with a new series of Squib Squads in this episode I am going to go in depth how to set up your Newcastle United squad Really underrated team, only 4 stars, they should really go up in FIFA 13 Because they had a brilliant season in the Premiership, uh, came something like 5th or 6th Which is way above expectations for Newcastle uh, So anyway I'm going to be showing you how to set up this squad so you can take on the top teams, the top 5 star teams with them. Anyway, so they're going to get into their formations and I'm just going to use what I s which suits me best and that's going to be my custom 4-3-3 formation as you can see. Uh, it's very wide for the attack, gives them lots of room to get down the wings. Um, midfield is quite compressed, it's going to be hard to break down and defence is just a nice back line but the two fullbacks are pressed further on up the field so they can make the overlapping runs down the wing uh, it all helps out in the end okay so that's my custom formation uh, you choose whatever formation you like suits your best but for this setup it's going to be some sort of 4-3-3 formation okay so go into the squad um, again the, well they've got he's quite an underrated t keeper again he's only rated 74 but I, I think that rating's going to go up in FIFA 13 Tim Krul uh, great player and the uh, centre backs Colacini, he's the main guy he con he's a great defender in the premiership so you don't really have to change much with the defence because uh, there's not many better alternatives than what you've got here don't be put off how the none of them are above 80 in defence but they are very underrated and I can uh, tell they'll definitely go up in FIFA 13 ok into the midfield and you've got Obertan he used to be a 5 star player in FIFA 11 but he's only 4 star in FIFA 12 but I still use that to my advantage because I like doing the skills but there's not many players on this Newcastle side who do the skills uh, so I'm going to put him on the left um, left wing So because he, he's got a right foot so he can cut inside he can do skills, not all the skills but 4 star skills including like the rainbow flick etc so I put him on the left wing so he can cut inside shoot with his right foot Check Teote, brilliant player. Anyway, I'm going to be taking off this guy, Amiobi, for where was it? I think I've gone past it actually. Yeah, uh, Danny Guffrey. You might you might think well, he's only 72, and you're bringing off like a well, he's a striker, but he's a very good player. Again, he's underrated. Um, Teote and Kabai, they're brilliant players, but I'm going to swap them around because um, Kabai. He's got a great shot on him, um, and I like to have him a bit further up the field so he can um, take the shots instead of obviously Teote taking him because I think he's got a better shot on him. He's got the finesse shot so he can curl it if he gets around the edge of the box. Okay, then you're coming into the strike that we've got. Um, Leon Best, he is a brilliant player, but there is a better alternative. And Demba Bar, 79th player. He's just into the squad, but he did very well this season, got a lot of goals and some quality goals too and Gutierrez he's a brilliant brilliant player and I do like him but I prefer Ben Arthur he's a 5 star player and he's the only reason why I'm actually doing this uh, this um, Newcastle squad today because um, not many people play him but he's a 5 star player he's scored some incredible goals this season in the Premiership I'm not sure if you've seen him um, but he's a left foot player I'm playing him on the right so he can cut inside um, and take him with his last shot and do all the skills. If you want, you can take off Guffrey and put on Gutierrez back in that position because he is a 79 rated and Guffrey is a 72 rated. Um, so there you go, and that is my Newcastle squad. It's underrated, but you can challenge the best of teams, all the five star teams, especially if you set them up right, choose the right players in the right positions. Um, I hope you like this. By the way, next episode, <coughs> I am going to be doing um, Benfica because you asked for it, but uh, I was already had this one planned. Uh, so that will be in the next episode, Benfica. You leave your comments in the, the comment section below telling me what teams I should do next, what teams you think are underrated and uh, need a bit of coaching. So thanks very much for watching. I hope you do enjoy this. Please come check out my channel for the montages, etc. and the, the short clips. Um, please be sure to comment rate like and please subscribe if you haven't already to this channel uh, so uh, thanks for watching and I'll talk in the next episode